Go to the Operation layer. Drag and drop from the Object List Controls, Button Controls, a Push Button Control into your worksheet and place the Push Button next to the EV logo in the left upper corner. Click with the right mouse button on the Push Button to open the Context menu and select Modify Properties. The Push Button class dialog opens. There you can find all properties of the Push Button. Change the caption to Configuration and press Enter. In the line Bitmap, please choose a larger push button bitmap. For example, push button turquoise 110 by 30.bmp. Change the font to size 12. Click on the Advance button in the lower right corner of the Push Button class dialog. The properties for Push Button 1 dialog opens. In the line Click, please enter Change Layer equals 1 and press Enter. Close the Properties for Push Button 1 dialog and the Push Button class dialog. Click once into the background next to the Push Button to deselect the button. Click on the Push Button. IrisNet changes to the Layer 1 configuration. Go back to the Operation Layer. Select the Push Button, copy it, and paste it twice. Position the three Push Buttons on top of the worksheet directly one next to the other. Click with the right mouse button on the middle Push Button to open the Context menu and select Modify Properties. The Push Button class dialog opens. Change the caption to Operation and press Enter. Under Advanced, in the line Click, change the entry to Change Layer equals 2. Close the properties for Push Button 2 dialog and the Push Button class dialog. Click with the right mouse button on the right Push Button to open the Context menu and select Modify Properties. The Push Button class dialog opens. Change the caption to Supervision and press Enter. Under Advanced, in the line Click, change the entry to Change Layer equals 3. Close the properties for Push Button 3 dialog and the Push Button class dialog. Select the three push buttons so that they all have a red frame. Click with the right mouse button on one of the push buttons to open the context menu and select Edit Object Visibility. The layer selection dialog opens. Select the layer's configuration, operation, and supervision and confirm your selection with OK. The navigation bar is finished. Click once in the background to deselect and test the navigation bar. Don't forget to save your project file. 